Here we are, 2018 Computex at the Seasonic booth, and they've got some new concepts going on that are pretty damn cool. The first one being their modular cable management system. They actually don't have a name for it officially yet. It's really early in the design phases, but as you can see here, you can plug all your cables off this one module system, and then from there, just a really short run from the power supply to the system itself. It's going to be great for system builders who want to make that real clean look. Seasonic promised me that they're only losing 1% efficiency overall so you're really not losing much but you've got a lot to gain in terms of the rear of your case and the aesthetics also saving those cables as well so if you've watched some of my videos in the past cables have been running everywhere like a jungle sandwich essentially I'd like to see them fix this thing and call it the jungle sandwich fixer but that's what's coming in the works they've also got some other products to so stay tuned we've also got an interview with Sam from Seasonic he's gonna tell us about the power supplies what goes into them and also why they're some of the best in the business Hey mates, 2018's Computex coverage was brought to you by Gigabyte and Corsair, bringing you that gear that you need to put in your PC and build PCs. Welcome back to Tech Yes City, and right here we have another new design coming in from Seasonic, and if the power supply dies and you're in the server market, bang, just take it out, replace it, put a new one back in and you are now good to go. Also with this system, you can double down the power. So if you've got 800 watts here and you're like, I want to add another 800 watts to the system, grab another unit, plug it in. That's what Seasonic are bringing to the server industry, as well as giving an integrated design with OEM manufacturers with simple designs that come in at a budget. If you're NZXT, for example, you're buying a lot of power supplies, they've got that covered for you as well. So here we are now at the Seasonic power supplies and I'm joined by Sam. How you doing, man? I'm pretty good. How you doing? Really good. Loving the environment here at Computex 2018. And behind me now, we've got the mainstream Focus Gold and Platinum Power Supplies. We've also got niche products besides that. And then we've got the flagship Titanium Series as well. We're going to run through the Focus Gold Series first, though. What uh, is so good about this lineup of power supplies here? Basically, Focus, you know, and then Focus Plus Series are, you know, Seasonic's bread and butter, you know, technically speaking. Um, you have your, you know, your platinum efficiencies, your gold efficiencies, and a semi-modular variation as well. You know, we're trying to cover up the entire range of, uh, you know, budget builders, somebody that's looking for, you know, quality, but at the same time, functionality as well. So, you know, we're kind of trying to cover, you know, from ranges from 550, uh, 450 for the semi-modular all the way up to 750. You know, for full modular variations, you got 550, 650, 750, and 850 all the way up to 1,000. You know, if you know you want some type of reliability, you know, see Sonic is the way to go. And at the same time, you know, we also got you covered with a long warranty as well. So, you know, you got nothing really to worry about at this point. So now we're at the niche products here with Seasonic's Power Supplies. They got the Snow Silent Edition. Obviously, as the name implies, Snow White. They've got this in a build on display here as well. And then they've got a new one, the Air Touch. So what's so special about the Air Touch? I believe you were telling me five-stage fan controller as well, right? Yep, that's right, Brian. So it has a five-stage fan control. If you just spin it this way a little bit. We revamped the uh, hybrid fan controller button that you see on the Focus and the Prime series. But basically, we put an LED in there just to... Um, you know, indicate what fan mode that you're actually in. So as Brian said before, there is a five-stage fan controller in there from silent all the way to the low RPMs, all the way up to like, you know, max, you know, max flow. Basically this power supply in a nutshell is for red and black theme builds. You've got uh, the same parts going in from the Prime Series that is going into this. It's built really well, got five-stage fan control, I don't know what else you'd need. It's also 170 mil in length. Now, going in lower sizes, I believe 550 watt, 650 watt and under, you then drop down to 140 mil in total length of the actual unit itself. Of course, picking these things up, they are really heavy and you get what you pay for with Seasonic Power Supplies and that's pretty much the best. But we're going to move over now to their flagship, which really is the best. Let's see what that's about. Here behind me now is the granddaddy, the finale of power supplies. I was not going to chuck it. I pretend I'm going to chuck it. But this is what you get when you want the best. Is this right, Sam? That is absolutely correct. The Prime platform is our flagship models. Uh, it goes from you know titanium, platinum, and gold efficiencies. Uh, basically, it comes up to uh, titanium is the highest wattage will be about 1,000 watts, all the way down to about 750 watts, I believe. And then, you know, when you move down over to a platinum version, we go up, boost that up to about 1300 watts now. So it's perfect for anybody that likes to do video rendering, have multi GPU setups, you know, same thing for the gold as well. And we also on this side, if you want to take a look, we have our, uh, you know, the highest wattage 
fanless power supply that you could get on the market at this point. Completely silent, there's no fan at all. Just, I'm not really sure what more you can want with a power supply. <laughs> so we're talking complete silence. So if you don't even want a fan in your power supply, this is what the Prime Titanium 600 fanless series will do. Now I know there's guys out there who go OCD about noise. I actually sold a computer and I had to, they, someone brought the PC over and I had to pull out the fan because they were complaining that it was going full speed. Now this was one of Corsair's fans that was just completely whisper quiet and I was shocked. I was like, wow, people must really get OCD about noise and that's why power supplies like this now exist, right? Yep. Just absolutely no fan, and now you've got the ability to power up to 600 watts. Uh, what about overpower on these? Uh, it basically has all the same protections that you get on the Prime platform. You have OVP, OCP, everything that you need. If anything goes wrong, it will shut down that one particular port, and everything else will still complete, it'll still stay on. So, yeah, basic. It's really nice, you know, there's really not much you can, you know, what more you can want for a power supply. So now we're going to get on some questions with Sam. One thing that I'm really curious about is when other manufacturers use Seasonic as an OEM. I've never really heard much of the story behind it. I've just heard when, you know, when companies, uh, you know they're using Seasonic inside those power supplies, you know it's good. You know, okay, that's, we're going to buy that, it's good. Uh, what goes on behind the scenes there? Are they using just the PCB or are they making their own steel cage for it or what? Well, basically what other companies do, uh, you know, like Corsair or EVJ, for example, they, you know, give us their specifications and details. And we build it for them in our factories, you know, you know, you get the same type of quality that, you know, we put in our own products. But, you know, at the same time, you know, those companies are basically just, you know, just branding retail companies at, the, at this point. Power supply manufacturers, you can probably only name a handful of it. Um, you know, in the entire world, there's not many people that actually do it. Seasonic, however, you know, we make our own, brand our own, sell our own. So now a big thing that's on my mind as well, uh, companies like Seasonic, they pride themselves on having a good product. Now, part of that good product is definitely quality control, right? Can you tell us what goes in behind the scenes with quality control with a Seasonic power supply? Sure. Uh, quality control at our company, you know, is pretty intensive and excessive at, you know, at every single point. We run it through the rings, uh, put a max wattage, the, you know, the lowest load that you can possibly have. And at the same time, you know, we put it in hot, cold testing, you know, put it through the ringer pretty much. And we're pretty confident in our quality control. That's why we can actually uh, sport a 12 year warranty for these units. The Focus has a 10, seven years. And essentially all those components inside are rated to that year life at that max potential, right? Yes. So all our components are rated to be, you know, to be very, very long lasting. That's why we can sport and back up our warranty claims. So it's sort of, uh, you're not going to blow your house up with a Seasonic power supply? No, you're never going to blow anything up. <laughs> there you go, guys. So basically, Seasonic anti-home blowing up power supplies. Really good. Thanks for having me, Sam. Oh, thanks for stopping by at our booth, Brian. No, not a problem. If you guys have any questions for Sam or Seasonic, be sure to drop a comment in the comment section below. I'll get back to you, or Sam will get back to you, or people at Seasonic will get back to you as soon as possible. And also, if you enjoyed this video, then be sure to hit that like button, and I'll catch you in the next one. Oh, peace out for now. Bye. <laughs> Give me the money. Hands off the merchandise. <laughs>